Hello, and on behalf of the Chief of Air Force, Air Marshal Hupfeldt, welcome to the 2022 Air and Space Power Conference. And the purpose of this conference is to further the opportunity for stability and cooperation such that we will reduce the span and the impact of future conflict. It's my great pleasure today to officially announce the stand-up of Australia's Defence Space Command. I want to congratulate the newly appointed head of that command, Air Vice Marshal Kath Roberts. It's events like these which can help translate intent into action. Space is more than the Earth. Um, we're already looking at what we need to do for the Moon, um, and we're already looking at what we need to do for the Moon to Mars. We need to increase how we physically interact, whether that's through training, education, forums such as this, but also mutual respect. The main issue is culture. People need to have permission to innovate. They need to believe that they can go ahead and shake things up and get a different manner of going about it. To ensure that those cutting edge capabilities are able to connect, are able to talk to each other, so that as a coalition we are able to share that situation understanding much better. The survival of our rules-based order will depend on the strength of our collective determination and our sustained attention span over time. It's about maintaining space as a realm of peaceful, scientific and commercial endeavor. About safeguarding the idea that our universe is open for exploration, for discovery, and for increasingly for human travel. And so, that tomorrow's seven-year-olds may safely look up at the sky, the night sky, with a sense of wonder and awe. Your ability to work together with all the elements of military power and the instruments of national power are key to our effectiveness. At conferences such as this one, we'll have tangible benefits to this outcome and to your much valued service. The future of air and space power is you.